Guys, I have some bad news. Remember when we saw Oriana's mom come out? 665 says something. Isn't she the one that slit and then dot dot dot? At that moment, I didn't realize what's going on. But then I realized, started thinking. The guy's name is Lord Perv Asshat for a reason. Not Lord Limp Dick. This dude is clapping Ori on his mom's cheeks. And the most fucked up thing is, now he's marrying the daughter of the mom that he's clapping. It's like, what the fuck? How is he getting away with this? 559 is objectively right. Oriana kind of did betray the mission, but do you blame her? I don't blame her at all. I would also protect my mom. But if what the new knowledge of Oriana's mom perhaps being so down back, she's getting her fucking booty blasted. Technically, she has no choice. She's probably a hostage, but still kind of fucked up. Maybe she, maybe 559 was her. It's so hilarious how she immediately just went for the kill. She's like, nah, fuck your mom, Oriana. I specifically brought you out here just so that you can see me kill your mom. Didn't happen, but she is savage. Her powers at the end of the episode, I mistakenly thought that she healed everyone. It was kind of, it was kind of weird, right? Cause Shadow showed up in, in the sky and then, you know, 559 started like getting really powered up and then everyone started healing. And at that moment I thought, oh, is this 559 doing it? No, it's like a similar recovery atomic kind of power that Shadow has. Now, this episode, I'm not sure if we're gonna get a conclusion immediately, but still, I want more 559 on Oriana. Let's begin today's reaction. Oh, Lambda, she always has her eye closed. What's going on? Is she sealing her powers? What is it? Alpha? Oh, sorry, sorry. Omega and Kai. They're all getting lines? This is so rare. Hmm. She defected. That's true. That's exactly right. It is betrayal, but at the same time, context matters. <laughs> that means you failed her, Lambda. It's your fault. Is Lambda gonna join the fray? Is she gonna actually participate in this arc? Yeah. He's going in. That hole, I love how that atomic hole is still there. Oh, we're not gonna kill her, but I wonder what's gonna happen here. How is Shadow gonna solve this? We got a flash step? Show me it. Oh, oh. Who was that? Epsilon! Oh my goodness. Oh, those are definitely fake, but it's okay. It's okay. Even if they're fake, I accept her. Yo, this season, Delta has been hard carrying. Delta and Gamma. But well, finally, Epsilon gets the moment to shine. Look at Lord Pervasat's portrait. Damn, Epsilon got that hookups. Oh, we're her students. Remember, she is the best at controlling magic in Shadow, in Shadow Garden, I'm pretty sure. Other than like, you know, Sid, of the Seven Shades. That's why she can also cure possession, along with Alpha. Pervasat! Did his hair grow? What the fuck? He got like a rat tail now? Hmm. I don't like that, that Epsilon has to color your grace. The guy on the right's look is so fanatic, look. <laughs> At least try to be discreet, how are you gonna laugh? Yeah, he is the most stereotypical one. Zenon Griffey! He clapped his ass. <laughs> Wrote to a named character. <laughs> They're all NPCs. Aww. My best student ever. Really? You're gonna be so strict about this? I mean, technically, he's doing the right thing. Oh, okay. Moonlight Sonata, let's go. We are the OG Moonlight Sonata enjoyer. <laughs> Look at him, someone take so many pictures. Just so excited. Nah, y'all had no clue. He's gonna blow you away. We should steal all the rings. Yeah, Moonlight Sonata again. Who's this? White feathers. Before it was black feathers when he when he was in shadow mode in season one. <gasps> the Moonlight Sonata! But Beethoven didn't exist in this realm, so it's probably insane to them, right? <laughs> Epsilon's crying. Oh never mind. He's stealing the rings. Brilliant! He steals the rings, he's looting them while they're too mesmerized by his playing. <laughs> Clap! Applaud! Wait, are we gonna ignore the slime underneath? Okay, sure. Oh my god. Her voice acting. Epsilon's voice acting, so much emotion. 
What's he doing? Expensive shit? Steal it too. Oh, John Smith powers. How the fuck did he... S How did that work? I, I don't know, but he extracted the ring. As in, he just wants to walk around and steal more shit? Who is this girl? Am I forgetting who this is? Margaret. Okay, Oriana's like personal maid? Oh my god. Epsilon's getting cucked. Epsilon is sitting in the cuck chair right now. Boing, boing, and these are real. These are fake. Zero percent in the on the other side. Oh! Emotional damage! Is it that simple? You just play piano once and all the girls just fall for you like that? Boing. Become his personal pianist. That's right, become his personal pianist. I mean, for money, he would... He would do anything for money. Are we actually going that way? Bro, you don't even need money, just ask Gamma! Oh. What did they do? God damn. We just met her. She's only seen us play piano. She's, this girl is so down, but... Wait, who is this? One of the royals. Yeah, yeah, she does. We haven't seen a moment like this from season one. Like, in season one, that happened when Oriana was holding Sid's hand in the train, I think. If Sid visits Oriana right now... Huh. How would she feel? She'd probably be so happy. Really? She hates her? Yeah, she's great. Why do you hate her? Oh, because we killed her dad. But like, it was to free him of the control. And the kingdom in shambles... The displacement of the kingdom is an unfortunate byproduct of Oriana's actions, I guess. Hmm. Really? If he just whispered in her ear, she'd tell. <laughs> Look, she wants to tell. <laughs> she, I, she's so unbelievably down bad. This exact same thing happened when we snuck out of the hand and she's like, Oh, where'd the hand go? She is. Huh? Who the fuck are you, mushroom head? Bro, look at his belly. <laughs> this shirt is too small for him. Buddy, you're just a castle guard. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Wasted taxpayer money, bro. These guards don't do shit. Not my fault you don't get bitches, bro. Tilt more. Tilt more. <laughs> this is actually insane lower body strength from Sid to be able to do this. <laughs> One more time. One more time. Do it again. <laughs> so he's in love with Margaret. Okay. <laughs> my little Mega Muffin. My little Maggie. She's disgusted by you, bro. She's absolutely. <laughs> Look at him. He thinks he's the main character. Oh my god. That was amazing. That was actually amazing. Yeah, she. she her look. That was absolute disgust. Oh, Cult of the Apples. Wait, 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 wait. Go back. Go back. Discarded! This isn't the symbol of the Cult of the Apples? I swear to God it is! 559 is coming for your ass. Yeah, she's gonna actually try to kill you now. Yeah, the Cult of the Apples side! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's obviously it, it is. I'm just, you know, just attention to detail. Sid! <gasps> wow! Hug! <laughs> Oh, dude, it's been so long. Remember the burger wrapper? Remember the burger wrapper he gave her? All for you, baby. All for you. We can't let it happen. Wow. Oriana's the one that pulled her hand away and Sid get, got it back. He's more busy with the snacks, dude. I think he just wants to eat the snacks. Yeah. Eat more biscuits. 
Come on. Oh? But I understand you. What a dramatic soundtrack playing. Hmm. To be the eminence in shadow. Maybe this is true. Oh. <laughs> there were so many good moments in season one like that. Bro! <laughs> the way he's keep eating it! I'll be there. I'll accept you! <laughs> you can't say these epic lies with biscuit crumbs on your face! Oh. Oh. Perverting it. Yeah, it had to be done though. <laughs> but that was being controlled, but he truly doesn't understand her. Sid just didn't pay attention. She has no other choice. But if you were to help out, Sid, maybe we have a choice. Man, she let go of her hands. No! Damn, she's even pushing us away. Oh. Let's kill him right now. The fuck? Okay, I thought Lord Pervasa slapped for a second, but never mind. Fucking mom, ah! I don't like it. Is the, <laughs> the mom's panties? I think the mom is getting bribed with all these fancy clothing and the luxurious life, and she's just chilling. She doesn't give a fuck. Terrible mom. He, stole, he took the fucking biscuit tray. He took the biscuit tray, but I think he has more context on what's going on. Oh, is it? It wasn't like an important box. We have the ring? Dude, we should crash the wedding and propose. Oh, 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 oh. That's a lot of motion. Boing. 559! Getting discipline from Epsilon! Does 559 directly report to Epsilon? But some members, they directly report to other specific members. Like, promote. So, Epsilon, her promotion banks on Epsilon's review. Okay. Hmm. We held her hand. 559, when was the last time you held his hand? <laughs> Excalibur! <laughs> oh my god! The ring they found in the ruins. Is it the ring that we stole from Pervasat? Hmm? The Black Rose? Black Rose is some kind of weapon? It created this landscape? It's like an I'm Atomic level of nuke? Uh oh. Sit. 559 five, and sit. <laughs> she immediately got her in the fucking knee. <laughs> yeah, what's 559 five, gonna do? What she got for us? <laughs> Chill the fruit, ready to serve him? Oh. No, you gotta feed it to us. She is in. Oh my god. I mean, he is right. It's crazy the 18559 does. This is Mordred, I think, of the rounds. Yeah, 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 yeah. Perv Asset reports the Mordred. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Black Rose. The weapon, Black Rose. <laughs> He's about to open the fucking ring box. It's got No, open it to show him. Come on. <laughs> See? He's not even a member of the round. Just like Zenon Griffey. Yes, Dio. Open the box. Open the ring box. Come on. See that old fool? Mordred? <laughs> Nothing is there, bro. <laughs> but he thinks he's on top of the world. Oh, that's a lot of ass. Don't tell me. Don't fuck. Go, go. Don't. Oh my god. Mom. Oh my god. Is that a cat call? Is that the signal? Fucking ring the sex alarm. She is terrible. Her mom, fucking terrible. But goddamn, a lot of panties from her. A lot of cheeks. Oh, don't moan. Don't moan. Don't moan. Absolutely fucking deplorable from Mama Rose. I'm sorry, Oriana. Like, I mean, if you're in her position, 
And I guess your dad died. I don't even know what the relationship was with the husband. Maybe it was like an arranged marriage and the mom was super young and then the husband was super old. So he's, I don't know, he's like immature. And now she has this opportunity to enjoy like a luxurious life. So now she just goes perv, perv, fucking clap my cheeks, perv. And now he's like, God, that even Lord Perv Asad's kind of annoyed at that, which is kind of hilarious. The mom needs some divine retribution. We're going to give it to her. Mm, I hope Pi Pi Nine actually does something now. Rose, she seems pretty defeated, but with Sid here, maybe she can turn it around. More importantly, Black Rose, a weapon. Judging by that map, that crater size, it seems to be an attack on the scale of Ivan Atomic. Probably not on the same scale, but it did create that gap, which is super promising. Some kind of new weapon for the future. Epsilon fan service, God bless. 559 fan service, amazing. The maid, Margaret, and the castle guard. Dude, okay, sometimes this show cooks really hard with support characters like Quentin or Goldie, right? There's some really funny moments. That guard, I thought we we're gonna see him again, but goddamn, that was one of the funniest shit where he's like turning around, like in his head, he thinks he's a fucking giga chat, but he's got his fucking belly out. And like Margaret's like, what the fuck is going on? He's like walking in with a smile on his face. Probably one of the best side character moments from Emerson Shadow. But hey, if you're still here, if you'd enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.